Yeah, as mentioned, my name is Johannes, and I'm one of the co-founders of Frankfurt. We are a Frankfurt-based SIS fintech, and our mission since 2015 actually is to grant SMEs and capital market participants access to equity and the capital market. I know that sounds pretty broad and pretty general, so I want to dig a little bit deeper into what I actually mean. When you look about the last financial crises, I have to say crises, so the plural, they had one in common. The regulator saw that the equity base of company was just too low. Especially in Europe, um, SMEs had an equity rate about 15%. In 2013, it was 20%, and that now rose to 28%. All the Basel 1, 2, 3 you've heard about, the regulatory frameworks, had one thing in common, that the regulators saw that uh, made sure that banks and eventually companies need more equity in their balance sheets. But why is it so that SMEs, especially in Europe, have so few equity in their balance sheets? Because when you compare it to the US market, they have 45% of equity in their balance sheet. Imagine you being an SME and you want to raise less than 10 million. It just didn't make sense in the past. You had to pay the same costs for prospectuses, for lawyers, for financial advisors, for all the legal paperwork coming with such an issue of financial instruments. So that made sense for companies who wanted to raise more than 10 million, but most of the company you find in the SME market are just below that threshold. That led, led to big dependency on banks. 90% of the, of the loans or of the debt came from banks. So, but how does Crowdesk help here? Yeah. Our solution offers SMEs and financial players a software, a legal framework, a technique with, with which they can raise up to 8 million without having any legal paperwork. We can set up a financial instrument in a matter of minutes. It's always the revolutionary part when we talk to old school bankers because they just can't imagine having in financial instruments in a blink of a moment. Because they, make, they know that, that it costed them months or even years to issue a new financial instrument, especially when it wasn't an innovative one. With our software, we can make sure that this process of issuing, of collecting money, is safe and secure. To give you more insights about how we actually do that, the most easiest part is that you come to us, you say how much you want to raise, we put that in our software, we give you an invest now button, you embed that on your website, and then you gather money from, from your network, from your partners, and then up to eight million can be done without any prospectus. We care about the, 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 the investing process and the administrating process. All that is built into the software, is scalable, and doesn't need any maintenance from you as, an, as a company. But we don't only serve SMEs. We are proud to have over 50 customers uh, no, in, in our portfolio, and some of them are even banks. And you now you may ask, he talked about SMEs, what do banks come and play? And he talked about a, lot, a lot about equity. Bank equity doesn't make sense, actually. But the banks are our most happy customers because nowadays they can only offer loans. They can only offer debt. With our platform, they can offer their business clients an access to equity capital. So the DKB Bank, especially from Berlin, you might know them, the biggest retail bank in Germany with 8 million customers, sets up a platform with us where they put their business clients on and they can raise, I said, the 8 million from the private clients and the bank, bank makes money out of that. So it changes actually their business model from being just another loan provider to being an equity provider. On the other hand, we have financial companies. This is probably the most boring part of our solution, but yeah, we naturally serve them. These are just customers who made their sales through human-based contact. So they have uh, people walking around selling their product, their financial instruments, and they now digitize their market. So like Vatner, we became from 
in the blink of a moment, their biggest partner of issuing of the biggest sales partner. They make over 25% of their sales now through our digital solutions. And last but not least, I started with the SMEs, which is for me the most inspiring part because there we can really help SMEs having more equity in their balance sheets. So to put that in a nutshell, we from Crowdtask are an SRS company. We are unfortunately not raising money at the moment. We just closed the round in the beginning of the year. We will probably um, make another round in the beginning of next year. Our current state is that we are 30 highly motivated people in the heart of Frankfurt in the Bahnhofsviertel working on our mission, on our solution, on our vision. We are making up to three million in revenue this year where one million is in um, annual recurring. Our business model is that we get a smart, um, a, a s small transaction fee, so that's our kicker. And adding is um, a tra an, um, recurring um, rent for, for each month. The software is, is rented. The good thing is the banks give, give us so much credit that they sign contracts up to 10 years. So we have a lot of stability, adding to a lot of um, expansion. We grow over 100% each quarter. So this is a high market or high volume market. And I'm happy to discuss our model with you afterwards. Thank you very much.